Welcome to episode seven thirty six, Ted Turner Nine Lessons. This is an outline of episode seven thirty six, lesson one to lesson five. This is lesson six to lesson nine. Lesson one: A turbulent childhood. By the time he was twenty four, Ted Turner has experienced plenty of tragedies. In his family, lesson two, he was a C student, breaking all the rules. Growing up, Turner was a C student and was rebellious. Eventually, getting expelled from Brown University. I got suspended. It was for having a girl at, in my room. Well, in those days, that was against the rules. But I didn't have any any money, so I couldn't go、uh, rent a hotel room. Lesson three, his biggest achievement is CNN. It took him 15 years, from 1970 to 1980. On June 1st, 1980, CNN aired its first broadcast. Good evening, I'm David Walker, and I'm Lois Hart. Now here's the news. President Carter. It took five years and 250 million dollars before CNN turned a corner financially, and Ted was working around the clock to make it happen. I lived for 20 years in my office. Which was right in the CNN building. Right. right I lived on a couch in my office the first ten years. Lesson four: How the small attacks the big. There are many ways. One way is to start at Atlanta, where he can do business a lot cheaper than New York or L.A. And then there's another way too: hit hard and hit fast. Question was: Would I run out of resources before it turned the corner? And there was no way I could know about that until I went ahead and did it because I didn't have enough capital to see it through. But、uh, in my study of history,、uh, Erwin Rommel in the desert never had enough petrol to for his offensives against the British to finish them. But he had to depend on capturing、uh, fuel supplies、uh, from the British by attacking so quickly. And、uh, catching them off guard, that they would、uh, retreat and leave the leave some petrol for him to finish. That it was it was dicey and it didn't always work. But、uh, I knew that was what I was going to have to do. I was going to have to hit hard and move incredibly fast, and that's what we did. Move so fast that、uh, that the networks wouldn't have time to respond. Lesson five: How to lobby. Congress. They changed the regulations,、uh, and I was doing some. I started lobbying. A, a lot of the battle that we fought in the television business、uh, were fought to a large degree in Washington against the networks, the broadcasters, against the motion picture studios,、uh, and against the sports leagues that didn't want、uh, didn't want us to take our little station. And but.、Uh, We were able to convince Congress uh, that uh, that it would be good for the good for business because it would create competition to the three networks where there was none before. Lesson six: Set goals so high you can never achieve them. In a rare moment of clarity, Ed Turner takes his son aside. He advised me to set my goals. Higher than I could possibly achieve in my lifetime, so there'd always be something unaccomplished that I could keep working on. He said he made a mistake、uh, setting his goals too low. It is one of the last pieces of advice Ted's father would give him. Lesson seven: You need courage, imagination, and thinking. You have to have a lot of courage. And you have to have a lot of imagination because you have to figure out what you're going to do from scratch. I mean, you could, you know, you can do a lot of things from scratch that aren't going to work out. And I can best tell you how I did it.、Uh, I I spent a lot of time thinking. I had done a lot of reading, and、uh, when I had spare time, a lot of times I would just think. And not waste my time watching TV. I did. I watched very little television growing up, hardly any at all. And、uh, because I, I, I thought, and 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 your mind is just like、uh, any other muscle in your body. If you lesson eight, one 
billion dollar gift to the United Nations. He shot to fame in the charity world 21 years ago when he made a shocking and historic billion dollar pledge to the United Nations, creating the UN Foundation. Lesson nine, he's the largest land owner in the United States and the world's first green billionaire. Much of it devoted to restoring the American bison. I think it's about 300,000. Really? And there's 200,000 in Canada. So this is about a half a million. So you saved the bison race. Well, Turner has a national chain of 45 restaurants under the name Ted's Montana Grill. They serve bison. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and leave your questions and comments below. Wishing everyone peace and prosperity.